I'm kind of, you know, it's, it's interesting. I, I, I watched you have Angela, who's got the, as the great stand up, you're kind of like the ground guy and then you have someone else. Yeah. <laughs> Is that kind of what, what the plan was or? No, not really. It just kind of happened. It only happened with just like teammates. And so that for Angela, definitely one of the reasons she brings me along and just because I have a good jiu-jitsu and I have wrestling jiu-jitsu that can kind of not only help her, you know, give instruction during the fight, but at the same time, fight week, you know, just help cut weight and train and stuff like that, you know. But uh, in that man, my, my expertise, in, you know, in fighting is definitely the business jiu-jitsu and then the wrestling takedowns. So I tried to help my teammates as much as they need, you know. Mm -hmm. And, you know, with Jessica Penne, um, you know, give me a little bit of insight. Um, you know, she's got a, a hell of an opponent on Saturday. L L yeah. Lupita, goodness. I had her on the podcast. I mean, I got to see her last fight. I mean, she's yeah. she brings a war. So what are you expecting out of this fight? Yeah, man, I'm definitely confident, you know, along my teammate Jessica, and she's been, man, she's been through so much, but she definitely got her head, like, like back in the fight game, and she's been very focused, you know. Like, we came here about three weeks ago, two weeks ago, you know, to fight, and the group popped for COVID, so we have to head back home and kind of, like, you know, regroup, but um, she's looking really good, man. She's been doing really good in sparring. You know, when it comes down to just she just believing in herself and, and really like beat this girl up because she, I believe she has everything to you know to shut this girl down. 